And we are back in our home after the harrowing, hallowing, hollow forest. Ho- hollow, hollow forest. Uh... That, that, well, you, that, you, want, you want to try that again? After the harrowing, hallowing, hollow forest. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll take that. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'm the Comic Foil. I'm the Green Scorpion. And I think, so, what I think is going to happen from now on is, I think the rest of the game is all events. I think so. And the next one, if I recall correctly, yeah, tomorrow's Valentine's Day. Yeah, and then, and then there is like an end game sequence, but I don't think we have a chance to finish any more social links. I don't think so either, but quite frankly, we got the ones we kind of wanted the most. Yeah. Unfortunately, I... we missed out on death. Yeah, we were so close with death. Um, and what... What happened to Shoe? Shoe? What happened? What did you do? I'm super curious about that myself now. Um, we barely got any... Like, you know, say what you will about, like, us not really going at it with the, with the athlete... Uh, social link but we left eye in the dust yeah it's not like i don't think that's a good social link it's just less interesting than the ones we were already doing why would you spend time with these people you kind of know over the people you're going into an alternate universe and saving the world like yeah yeah exactly i don't understand that mentality Uh uh-huh you will be able to, like, it is possible, in fact, super possible, to get them all on New Game Plus. Yeah. So, there you go. Something uh, to look forward to. February 14th. Today is Valentine's Day. Also, maybe if we have time, we can do some bonus episodes in the future where we look at some of the social link scenes. Oh, I, I was actually going to bring, I was actually going to, play through. I was actually going to bring that up um, yeah. later down the line, um, but we'll get to that in a bit. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you received one text message. That's it. That said one text messages, right? Yeah, it did. Okay. Um, you're coming to school today, right? I want to talk to you and stuff, so I'd like to walk home with you. Yeah, we'll spend time with Yukiko. I mean, yes. You decided to spend the afternoon with Yukiko. I like how she says talk to you and stuff. Like, we don't know what the day is. And stuff. Yeah, Valentine's Day is still a thing. Yep. Yo, comic! Things were tough yesterday. I never thought I'd get zapped by lightning in real life. Thanks to that shock or whatever, I totally forgot what today was. It's February 14th, you know? I didn't have much time to prepare myself this morning, so I've been nervous all... Prepare myself for this, so I've been nervous all morning. Uh, someone help me do something about all this pressure! Uh, believe in yourself. (laughs) I used to, back when I lived in the city. And it's been nothing but betrayal ever since! Oh man, if I end up just getting friend chocolates on those- and those only from Teddy, I'll never live it down. So yeah, I've explained this before, but Valentine's Day, significantly in, uh, Japan, is where the ladies give, like, chocolates to symbolize, uh, friendship and love to the me- uh, to the men. Okay. But a week- I think it's, it's like- It's like Sadie Hawkins rules, like- Yeah, but two weeks later, it's not expressed in this, but it is expressed in Persona 5. There's White Day, where it's the opposite. Okay. Where the men express their devotion to the women. Okay. So, th- there- there is that. Yeah. Hey, everyone! They posted the test results! Oh, yeah, that's also a thing! Oh, the awful moment of truth. Oh, well. Wanna check it out? So I don't think I'll be top of the class this time, because I did get one wrong. We did get a couple wrong, yeah. I got one wrong. Was it just one? Yeah. It it was one where it was Japanese names that I couldn't Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Your score was in the top ten. Wow, nice! Good going, comic. So smart. Uh, social link with friends congratulating you. You feel that you became slightly closer to your school friends. Does, Does that, that matter, matter much at this point? Yeah. Uh, lunch break is almost over. You decide to return to class. I don't know. Maybe. Who knows? I mean, if it does give me free time, I'll be surprised but pleased. Anyway, after school. More male students have stayed after school than usual. Huh? What should I do now? I'm gonna hang out here for a bit longer, but I don't know what to do. Hmm. I don't feel like there's anything for me to do at home anyway. Oh, I got it. I'll go up to the roof or something. 
I'm, I'm gonna be behind the school building. You know, just because. <laughs> Most of the girls are already gone. They're like waiting for girls to like come yeah. up to them and ask to be walked home, I guess. Yep. Hey, man, all these guys are obsessed with chocolate. They want candy so much, why don't they just <laughs> buy us some themselves? <laughs> Kanji doesn't know what day it is. Are you serious? This is the one day you shouldn't be buying chocolate for yourself. Yeah? Man, you're clueless. Whatever. I know I'm getting some for sure today. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I didn't bring you any. I'm not that pathetic. Come on, man. <laughs> I can get quite a lot. From part-time workers at Jeunesse. Okay, so who's that, um... Uh, I, I forget her name, the... the... The girl everybody hates. Uh... Atano? Oh, oh, uh... Uh... -huh. uh I, I know who you're talking about. Big girl back at the uh, camp, yeah, right? Yeah, big girl back at bad attitude. I I, I I feel like that's the inevitable punchline to this. Oh, boy. The important thing is that I have any at all. Right, Chie-san? Yukiko-san? Don't put them on a spot, man. I see you've got some big bags with you today. <laughs> wow, that's not the sound of desperation or anything. Yeah, I do have some. Right, Yukiko? Oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. I like candy. What makes you think it's going to you? It might be for me. You guys are clueless. Don't be so desperate. And I brought some, too. Oh, are you guys handing out chocolate? Great timing. Here you go, Chie-senpai, for always being so hardworking. See, Risa gets it. W why me? Because today's for giving out chocolate to the people you like, right? It's a great day to say thank you to all those people in your life, not just your romantic partner. Thank you, Risa. There you oh, go. Putting a new spin on things. <laughs> and for you, comic, I got this engagement ring. <laughs> She's so thoughtful. <laughs> Must be all those years in showbiz. Uh, Risa hands out chocolate to each person. I never thought I'd get chocolate from THE Risette in person. Don't make too much out of it. It's just friendship chocolate. Friendship chocolate tastes just as good. Yep, I assure you. Yeah, I figured. <clears throat> this chocolate is really good, so I hope you all enjoy it. Well, I have some other people to give chocolate to. Bye! Wow, her ability to avoid personal drama is impressive. Oh, Natokun! What are you all doing together? What's that supposed to mean? Today's a huge deal. <laughs> Nato also does not know what day it is. Ah, uh, I see. Well, if you'll excuse y me. You want to know what? I bet Nato received a lot of chocolate. Ah, uh, maybe. Not everyone knows her deal. She never breaks a sweat. Well, I know after we saved her from the TV world was when she like, when she like revealed to the school. No, she revealed to the group. No, she revealed to the whole school that that she was a girl. No, did she? Yeah, and she was even in the um, she she was even in the beauty pageant. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about that. Against her own will, but still. Yeah. No, you're right. Oh well, Kanji. Guess we're spending time with each other today. Sure. Why not? I mean, I still wouldn't be surprised if a bunch of girls gave her chocolate. Oh yeah. Though, like, let, let's be real for a moment. She she's still a handsome girl. <laughs> she she won that beauty pageant for a reason. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I totally feel like we missed the train here. <laughs> Attention, everyone! There, there was a thud on with that one. I have chocolates here with everyone's names on them. Please take your candy and go home. Okay. If you can't find yours, come see me later. <laughs> That's totally not a... Uh, that means you. <laughs> nice. Y Yukiko? <laughs> Man, Yukiko's being even bossier than normal. So, oh my lord. Like, and I know they're not going to write different dialogue for all the scenes for every possibility of who you're dating. Um, you know, I like, like, I respect that. I don't think they're underachieving here. Um... But I'm wondering, it, is the implication that Yukiko and I have been dating in secret and our friends don't know? 
Um, because that would explain. I, I know the real reason it's written this way is because they were only going to write one version of. Most yeah, scenes. yeah, yeah. But I wonder if the in-game reason is supposed, the in-universe reason is supposed to be that it's a secret. Um, I don't think so. I just don't think they're quite forthright with their relationship. It's not like they shove it in everyone's faces. Yeah. More like. Plus, um, yes, there are different variations of the scene depending on who you're dating. Specifically within the party. Chie will have different things to say, Risa oh, will have yeah. different things to say. Even Naoto will have a different reaction upon seeing you guys. Yeah. Um, I just know, like, party. in other scenes, like, in, like, the... Like, when they're telling ghost stories and stuff, or when, you know... Uh -huh, uh -huh. Risa hits on you in every scene regardless, and it's not like they always have your girlfriend be like, hey, I'm dating it, you know, they're not gonna bother writing that. Yeah, I think part of it might also just be because, like, they know Risa enough to know that, hey, she's not gonna hide her feelings, that's perfectly fine. Yeah. And again, like, when we saw the whole thing with, uh, the ski trip and everything, yeah, they, it's kinda clear that they know what's going on. Like, yeah. they, they didn't know what was going on in the shed, but they knew that, hey, yeah, these two are close. Yeah, maybe. Again, they I'm can't go really. Make sure, she's okay. Well, because right now they're like, "What? What's up with Yukiko?" Yeah, but it. Why did she say that? Oh, this is chocolate for everyone in it. Take yours and go home. <laughs> what the hell? Talk about being brushed off. Well, you don't want yours? I'll take it. <laughs> God, you moron! Of course I want it. Uh, you must go see Yukiko later. Um, this next scene does go into a little bit of explanation as to why the- why it was so abrupt. Yeah. Uh, you came to the shoreline with Yukiko. The cool air feels good. I bet you were surprised just now. I acted kind of weird. Yeah, but you always act weird. I like that <laughs> idea. I thought out all these ways to present it to you, and I practiced a big speech. But everyone was there, and I had such a huge box, and it was hard. This is for you. It's kind of big, but... Uh, this is a huge box of chocolate. That is a huge box of I chocolate. I wanted to make it myself, but everyone else at the end noticed what I was doing. L like, look, the like lid isn't even like fitting on. Like, it's some kind of like chocolate obelisk. <laughs> First they just supported me, but then they all started helping out. So, it's more like a gift from the entire Amagi Inn, instead of me. I only made a little part of it. That's probably but a blessing I in disguise. Think it tastes good. Um. Oh, I guess that she didn't make the whole thing. It's thought that counts. <laughs> I'll make it by myself next time, with all my love poured into it. Everybody at the Amagi Inn must like love me too. They're like, oh, oh man, Yukiko's been like so much happier lately. Probably, yeah. Will you open it? Uh, the gourmet quality chocolate gives off a wonderful aroma. It has a rich flavor and melts in your mouth. You can't stop eating. You shared the chocolate with Yukiko. That was good. The cooks sure are impressive. But I wish there was more depth to it. Oh boy. They stopped me, but I should have gone with my gut and used the squid ink. <laughs> Sounds just awful. <laughs> Next time, then. Yeah, I think it'll add a layer of complexity to the flavor. They are the same color, after all. <laughs> That's not all. Yeah. Oh, I can't wait until next year, so I'll try making it next week. Ah. Oh, oh, dear. Plan backfired. <sighs> I'm so glad I could give it to you. This is going to get sad now because I'm I leaving. I couldn't sit still. I've been thinking about this day for so long. I didn't know if we'd be able to spend the day together, but at the very least, I wanted to give you the chocolate and let you know how I feel. But even this huge present isn't enough to express the way I feel. My feelings for you are much, much bigger. When I was making the chocolate with everyone at the inn, I felt like you were with me, as if you were standing right by my side. <laughs> I had a little daydream about that. I'll be the manager, and you'll be next to me. When a guest comes, we'll welcome them together. We'll say, welcome, together. And that's how it'll be. That's nice. She's already thinking about the future. <laughs> <laughs> I could just yell, well, I'll just say that sounds nice. You think? 
But that means you'll have to be adopted into our family and take our name. Huh. Um, it's kind of an important matter, so... I mean, it makes me happy that you want to, but you should, um, think it through. Yeah, I mean, also we're teenagers. Yeah, we're, we're, <laughs> we're high school. We're in high school, you could go... Actually... Now that I think about it, no, in Japan, that that's that's the kind of thing they think about like that early. Yeah. Now that I think about it, comic amagi. Eh. Great. Now I'm starting to sweat. Comic amagi has a ring to it. Heck, I'm okay with that. Um, a cold wind is blowing. It should be really cold right now. But I don't feel any of that. Uh, the only sound you hear is the crashing of the waves. My heart is filled with my love for you. It's so warm. I feel like I'm going to melt. I'm scared that I'm going to disappear. I love you. Aww. I love you so much. Aww. With all that I am. And then they kiss. You can smell the sweet aroma of chocolate. You spent a long time with Yukiko. Oh, very nice, very sweet. I do, I do really like the uh, Valentine scenes. Uh, Dojima Residence, front door. The Teddy, the Teddy guy is, the, the Teddy Snowman is still there. Hi! Um, the, it's moving. You're late. That it's some, moving. That is some baleful chocolate. What are you doing here? Sorry, no, you're late. No, you're no, late. Oh, no, you're late. <laughs> yeah. I don't get it. What, do you know why I'm here? It's not hard to figure out. <laughs> you really are an oddball. It's moving. I have chocolate. You can have it. <laughs> it smells. <laughs> <laughs> More importantly, it's moving. That room doesn't have any eclectic loutwits. I did the best I could, but I don't know if it turned out any good. Eclectic loutwits? Yeah. Uh, electric outlets. Yeah. That 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 was a, that was an old thing. <laughs> oh, okay. Right. When we were like explaining the school to her. So. Right, right. Or, or right. she has to go somewhere where there would be a television because she wanted to like watch TV. Yeah. And she didn't know the right word. Sorry. Um. <laughs> this is incredible. Huh? It's okay? It's fine? Huh. What do you mean, incredible? <laughs> she picked up on her. Like, I can't you believe it. C can I? If you don't hurry, it'll melt. If it melts, it'll run away. A what? <laughs> you have a feeling of danger, but you've already accepted her gift. When you eat it, um... I want you to tell me whether it was good or not. Now. Uh, you seem to have no choice but to eat it. This can't be any worse than Mystery Food X, right? I don't know. This seems to be a living creature. <laughs> Despite the smell, it tastes quite normal. No, this is... You can't stop eating. You ate it all? That's incredible. Are you stupid? <laughs> <laughs> well, it, it makes my work worth it. Uh, you have the unsettling feeling that something is moving within your stomach. Valentine's Day isn't an actual ritual, huh? I looked it up. I thought it was some big event. You know, a turning point of your life. I'm so lame. I was fooled. I feel stupid. Ugh. Honestly, but you're not entirely not like off. I, I didn't make that chocolate just because I thought it was something I was supposed to. No, that, that makes it sound like I'm serious. Uh, well, I am serious, but... And you can just shut your stupid jerk face! <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm telling the truth! Look, just close your eyes. Shut up and close them! Thank you. Well, I don't really get it, but I won't forget about you. Ever. Aww. You spent some time with Marie. I hope it wasn't too good a time. I, I think we're good. I think we're good. Uh, Dojima residence, living room. It seems Dojima is away on business and can't come home. Big 
April, do you know what day it is today? I do know what day oh it is, Monica. Oh my gosh. Let's give your big bro chocolate day. Nope, what day is it? It's Valentine's Day. I guess there are some things even you don't know. I guess so. Aww. <laughs> this is my favorite chocolate. Nanako gives you some chocolate that is very popular with children. Thank you. It's sweet and yummy. <laughs> Dude, I ate so much chocolate my today. Teacher said yeah, for real. Valentine's Day isn't just a day to give out chocolate. It's a day to say thank you to the people you care about. Teacher gave us all chocolate. Everybody, even me. And when she gave it to me, she said, It's been tough for you, but you've done very well. Everyone tells me I'm strong for pulling through. That's why I said thank you back. And I said that my big bro and my dad are rooting for me. And that's why I can be happy again. Um, yeah, I'm proud of you. <laughs> really? And then my teacher was so happy. And then she said, when someone's cheering you on, even when you're in trouble, you feel energized. Do you feel like that when I cheer you on? Honestly, yeah. 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 Me too. When you root for me, I get so happy. We're the same. Me, my dad, and your friends are all on your side. Even if you go back soon, I hope you're happy. Aww. I had one more chocolate. I made it myself. Yeah, we, we've eaten like... Oh, no. That's a big... That looks like a slime. It's yeah, a slime it, it shadow. It looks like the enemy slime. Oh, 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 Lord. A strange object sits on the plate. By some miracle, it has no smell at all. The big girls taught me how to make homemade chocolate creations. They found a way. They found uh... a way to... Also, my uh, mouse has attracted to the chocolate. Let me just... Uh, it, it's sticky. Ah! Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, um, dear. That's why I made one for you. Uh, just who taught her how to cook? Your instincts honed after a year of battle are ringing warning bells in your mind. Chie said I should mix in iced coffee to add flavor. Of course it was Chie. Oh, and bacon. Since everyone likes bacon. I, I have had chocolate bacon and I have had bacon ice cream before. It's actually pretty good. It's all right. But yeah. I don't trust Chie with it. I, I feel like you need to know what you're doing to make it though. Yeah. Luckily, there was some bacon and iced coffee in the fridge. Why is it blue? <laughs> Risei-chan said that the chocolate should assert itself. So it needs to be either really sweet or really spicy. You're a grown-up, big bro. So I thought you'd appreciate a bitter taste. So I put bell peppers and wheatgrass juice in it. Oh my I gosh. I think that sour chocolate sounds really assertive. So I added vinegar and ponzu sauce too. Oh boy. Yukiko said that my chocolate would have depth if I added fish. So I added some fish sausage and some of dad's fermented squid. Oh no. And Naoto told me she'd let me borrow a recipe book. And when I told her I was already done, she told me that you'd enjoy anything that I made for you. Gosh darn yeah. it, Naoto. Naoto. You are our one saving grace and you ruined it. I thought Naoto couldn't give her any bad ideas and that was the worst idea of all. By the way, can can we take a moment to appreciate the fact that, uh, look who's on TV screen. Yeah, yeah, Tanaka's <laughs> selling some stuff. Oh no. Uh, Nanako looks at you expectantly. Um, big bro, thank you. I love you. I like how it said after a year of battle, yeah. referring not to like the fights we've had in the game, but to eating bad food. You have no options. It's. Ugh. Big bro? What's wrong, big bro? 
You can hear Nanako's voice from far away. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, at least that'll cleanse the palate of all the sweet chocolate we ate over the past day. Um, yeah, I Jesus didn't. Christ. <laughs> after getting some rest, you managed to recover your health. You don't remember anything after that. Time. Oh, no. A soft light is pouring in from outside. You should hurry to school. Oh, okay. oh, okay, here Good we go. Good morning. The weather's great today. It's even a little warm, don't you think? Hmm. I saw on the news that the first official spring storm was observed this morning. Spring is just around the corner, huh? Hmm. Spring, huh? Everything went by so fast. Aw. What's up? Hey, everybody. What's going on? It did go by fast. I looked the other day, because yeah. I couldn't remember when we started this playthrough. We started this playthrough in August of 2020. So we've also been playing, been doing this Let's Play for more than a year, and I, like, didn't even notice it had been that long. Goodness. Mm. Oh, nothing. We're just talking about how spring's almost here. Then Kamakun will. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I try not to think about it. But hey, we still have some time, right? No gloomy faces until then. Uh, yeah. Let's have some fun. <laughs> yeah! We're gonna pack your brain so full of good memories that you'll beg us to stop. Ah, oh, shoot! Well, let's go. Hey, wait for me! Oh, uh, and the title music plays. Yep. So I think this is where, uh, time goes forward. Yep. Wow, we were actually coming to the end, aren't we? Yep. Oh, they took uh, Nanako to the ski resort. Yeah. Uh, some more food. Make Teach her how to make actual yeah. chocolate. Got like, I don't know, popcorn. God, I love this theme. That's a pretty good picture, considering it's using the in-game models. Mm-hmm. I like the smile on Kanji. Yeah, that's just a very, like, content Kanji face. This is it. Uh, you have finished packing. You'll be returning to the city in two days. You decide to rest for today. Alright, guys. I think next time is going to be the finale. Yeah, so we will... Well, let's see where this last bit leads. Because I think, I think I know where this is going, but I don't exactly remember how long it's going to be. Um, I mean, I think we got a couple episodes yet, actually, but we're kind of... We're, we're coming. Next episode will be part of the finale. All right then. Um, so yeah, today was the Valentine's Day episode. Yep. Uh, spring has come once again. Uh, spring has once again come to Inaba. Uh, next time we'll uh, say our goodbyes to all these great friends that we've made along the way. Goodness gracious, man! We started this let's play a year ago, and we're finally at the finish line. Yep. Um, so until then, I'm the Comic Foil. I'm the Green Scorpion. And. Uh, yeah, don't be sad that it's ending. Be happy that it happened, and it'll happen a little more next time. And don't accept any chocolate that was made by those girls. You know, of all the things she said, I still don't understand why it's blue. Yeah, um... Was the fish, like, an outside coating? I don't know. Like, I imagine they... I, like, I could believe that they maybe put food coloring, yeah, but you'd think she would have mentioned dye. that. Yeah. No, I think it was so, like, supernaturally bad that it, like, turned radioactive. Ugh.